It goes in line with the hadith we have. How can I increase my iman? Well, this is not something that I could prescribe a pill for you or an injection and then, mashallah, it would boost your iman. It's a way of life. To increase your iman, as Ahl Sunnah believe, you have to offer good deeds and you have to say and refrain from bad deeds and it would happen by itself. The minute you pray on time, the minute you pray where you're supposed to pray in the masjid, not one, one prayer, but the five daily prayers on time in the masjid as Allah has prescribed. The minute you obey your parents and you respect them and you're kind to them, the minute you connect to your next of kin, those who are related to you from your father, or from your mother's side, even if they are bad and rude to you, even if they sever the kinship, even if they don't return your calls, even if they don't answer your invitations, you still go and connect them. The minute you do this, the minute you fast Ramadan without sinning, the minute you offer night prayers, the minute you fast voluntary prayers, Monday, Thursdays, the white three days of every month, Ashura, Arafah, etc. The minute you give charity to the needy and the poor, the minute you help those who need your help, the minute you meet people with a big smile, though they might not share this kindness with you, but you still do it for the sake of Allah. The minute you do all of this for the sake of Allah, you will find that your Iman is increasing a lot and also if you were to stay away from sin you will find that Allah Azza wa Jal is increasing your Iman greatly why because you're doing what you're supposed to do and Allah rewards those who do what they're supposed to do